How does an electric shock restart the human heart? When doctors place pads on a patient's chest and deliver an electric shock, it looks like they're jump-starting the heart. But that's not actually what's happening. To understand this, you need to know one important fact. Your heart is an electrical machine. Every heartbeat is controlled by tiny electrical signals traveling through a specialized network inside your heart. These signals tell the heart muscles when to contract and relax, creating the steady rhythm that keeps blood flowing. When the heart suddenly stops, it's often not because the heart is dead, but because its electrical system has failed. The signals become disorganized and chaotic, similar to a computer that has frozen and can't follow commands. This condition is called arrhythmia. Now here's the surprising part. A defibrillator does not force the heart to beat. It doesn't add energy to start life again. Instead, it does the opposite. The shock briefly stops all electrical activity in the heart at the same time. For a fraction of a second, every heart cell goes silent. And that silence is the key. In that moment, the heart's natural pacemaker, called the SA node, a small cluster of specialized cells, gets a chance to reset and take control again. Just like restarting a frozen computer, the system clears the chaos. When the SA node sends its next signal, the heart can return to a normal, organized rhythm. The heartbeat comes back, not because electricity creates life, but because it gives the heart one final chance to restore order. And sometimes, that's enough to save a life.